Hi everyone, welcome back to the React.js video tutorial and in this video we are going to study about the composition versus inheritance in the React.js alright so first of all I just want to clear the one thing that Facebook always prefer the composition and it's never tell that you have to use the inheritance inside the React.js for that I'm just going to show you the official statement on the React.js org website here you can see that Facebook is telling that at Facebook, we use React in the thousands of the component, and we never found that you found any use cases where we can would recommend creating the component inheritance uh, architecture. All right, so you can see that it never uh, tell that you have to use the inheritance. So now uh, maybe you just face some uh, kind of problem that where you see that you must have to use the inheritance. Uh, you cannot use the uh, common components here and the uh, child components here so for that i'm just going to take some cases and tell you that how you can resolve this all right so for example uh just i want to tell you that uh this is your sidebar uh, as uh, for example and you don't know how many contents are will be coming here and that how you can handle this component all right so with the composition i'm just going to handle this so now uh, let's see so first of all i'm just going to close this uh, react.js.org tab so first of all uh, I'm just going to make a component so this is a functional component and just going to write a sidebar alright so inside the sidebar I'm just going to return some data like uh, inside the div so here uh, uh, when you just make it uh, you uh, never know that how many data are coming here from your child parent component all right for example uh, let's say uh, you just want to pass the data something like this uh, just close it and like this and here just want to pass some h1 tag like here uh, sidebar data all right uh, just take it uh, sidebar data and how you can get this so you can see that uh, this is the header is here uh, which is coming from here but sidebar is nowhere but I you just passed here all right so how you will get there but uh, in case if you just pass your data as in props and I just just pass your sidebar uh, props then you can easily get it all right so if you just write here props and uh, if you just guide going to pass your props dot data then you can see that you got this data here but how you can get this so for that uh, facebook provide a very common uh, special props uh, which is uh, props dot children all right and if you just use this then you can cut that you can get the composite data here all right so this is about the composition so there is a lots of benefit like uh, you just pass the hundred hundreds and thousands of data from uh, any length of the menus so you can easily handle from uh, inside your data so i just you should just pass here then you can easily handle so just i'm just going to pass put a class here and the class name is sidebar so now you can see that everything is applied on here it's easy and let's say you have a children component one more children component like uh, function content content and you just pass your props or uh, you don't need to pass props here just return and uh, you get this data from here data one two three and four all right so if you just uh, have this you can directly pass this inside your component so that means you can pass the component inside the component so if I just work like this 
then it will going to be still work right so if i just put it uh, many time then you will got the many redundant data all right so this is about that uh, how you can use the composition and uh, 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 facebook tell that there is a uh, no such case that uh, found in the uh, Facebook that we have to use the inheritance and you cannot use the composition and the component way so this is all about inside the composition versus inheritance in the react if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe our channel thanks for watching